Hi everyone, welcome back. If you do not know, my name is Devin here on my channel, I cover all things beauty. That includes makeup, fragrance, and designer here and there. If you think that is something you'd be interested in, then I hope you stay and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell so you're notified every week when I upload. Today's video, we are doing a candle haul, you guys. Yes, it has been a minute since I did a candle haul. Y'all picked up 10 new candles, okay? 10. Um, I was just craving some new candles, some new scents. Um, so we got a little mixture of some tropical, some bakery, Easter, just a little bit of everything, okay? So if you guys are interested and want to see what brand new candles I got and my first impressions, then just keep watching. Y'all, I am excited for spring. Don't get me wrong, I love me some warm, cozy, gourmand, just goodness. But I am ready for some spring. I'm ready for some sweet, some tropical, some fruity. Just, I'm just ready, okay? And right now, this weather has me ready. The weather is in the 70s all this week here in Texas. So I'm happy, okay? Go ahead and start with the one candle that does not belong to me i picked up the mr a new candle so i got him dark amber and oud and it looks like this very very simple packaging not doing too much very you know simplistic so yeah this is from the white barn line and this is dark golden amber fresh rainwater and oud wood so when i saw the notes i felt like this will be a candle that he likes and I let him smell it and he does. It's a very simple, slightly sexy, manly candle. Like that's all I can say. Um, this is definitely one I know that I knew that he would absolutely enjoy. Hopefully the throw and everything is decent on this candle. I'll keep you guys updated with that. But yeah, I went ahead and got him this. Now I'm going to tell you the one wick candle I got. I actually got this in store the other day with a you know reward. And I usually get body care, but sometimes every now and again, I'll stock up and get um, one with candles because I like them. And I don't know if they're coming out with a full size one of this as of yet. I don't know if it's online yet or if they're coming out with it at all. My essay, she was unsure. This is from the new Easter line and this is the Tutti Fruity Candy. So I don't know if I've ever had the Tutti Fruity Candy candle. I don't know that I have and this is jelly beans mixed berries and sugared lemon and I feel like that smells what it smells like it's a very sweet cute little candle um I probably will burn this but not anytime soon um if they do come out with the big one I would definitely um purchase the big one but as of right now I only seen the minis so I went ahead and picked that up now the one candle that i am kicking myself for not getting is actually the easter candle um the carrot cake or something like that i did not pick that up and i didn't pick it up because i already have one from either last year or the year before so i was like i don't really need it but then once i seen people talking about like the packaging and the ceramic top and it's like a 30 something dollar candle I'm thinking, why didn't I get this? Um, um, but yeah, I wish I would have got that. But instead, I end up getting the new Happy Easter Daffodil Daydreams candle. Um, so this is a new scent to my knowledge. I don't think we've ever had this one before. This is Whipped Marshmallow Pastel Clouds and Sweet Daffodils. This smells really nice. I feel like it's a little light, but it is really sweet. I get that nice whipped marshmallow note in here. I wonder if I'm going to be able to smell like the daffodils on this when it burns. I don't know. But the packaging is really, really pretty. And I love putting out like specialty candles around, you know, Easter or Valentine's Day or something like that. So I was really excited to get this candle. So I probably won't be burning it anytime soon. Um... Or maybe I'll burn it once or twice and then put it up until around Easter. But yeah, I got this for packaging purposes. It is so, so pretty. And honestly, I kind of really like the scent in here. Next collection is going to be the Main Street Bakery collection. They came out with three candles. I don't know if they're going to come out with more. Now, out of the three, I only got two. One of them was actually Paris Cafe. And I already have that in my collection. The packaging was really, really pretty. And if there was a better sale, like a better sale, maybe I would go back and get that one. But honestly, 
I don't really need that one. Um, but the packaging is gorgeous. So I did get the other two. I went ahead and got Cherry Blossom Pound Cake, which looks like this. And the packaging is pretty. I wish they would do like a full wrap around, but you know, what can you do? This is Cherry Blossom Whipped Pound Cake and Vanilla Frosting. So I kind of like this candle. I seen someone say that they wasn't sure that they liked it because of the cherry blossom note, but I actually really like this candle. Honestly, I don't think I would mind this in like body care if they ever brought that out in body care either. It smells really nice to me. I do get a lot of the pound cake and a little bit of the cherry note in here, but it smells really, really pretty. And again, the packaging is absolutely gorgeous. Um, now, the only problem with these candles is I feel like the wax is pretty low in these. You see that? So I don't know if it's like that with all of them, but it's definitely like that with the other one as well. And this is just the Main Street Bakery. This is the one I was really, really excited for. This one has fresh banana, vanilla wafers, and cinnamon sugar. This one smells amazing. I don't know if it smells like a banana bundt cake or something or like banana uh, pudding or something. I don't know, but it's so good. It's really, really sweet. I definitely get that rich banana note in here. It smells amazing. This is one I would definitely consider purchasing a backup of because it just smells that good. And again, it's very low. Like, I don't know if y'all can see it. So if you guys have these candles, do, does yours look like that too? Or should I take this one back and get a better one? But this this smells absolutely delicious and i cannot wait to burn that one to close my blind a little bit because that light was just doing too much so next we're going to go ahead and move on to these two limited edition candles these are the ones people have been going crazy over and this first one is root beer float and it looks like this y'all the packaging in on here is kind of ugly like um, a lot of people were saying old school like games and it kind of does. I don't really love the packaging. So this one is a scoop of vanilla ice cream, root beer, and caramel drizzle. Now, right off the back, I don't like root beer. I'm not a root beer girl. I don't like to drink it. I don't like the smell of it. And I feel like this smells exactly like root beer. I don't know how to feel about this candle if I'm being honest. I just don't know. People were saying that the throw on this was crazy, but I don't know. I, I don't, I, I just don't know. I don't know how I feel about this candle. I think if you like root beer, you would like this candle, but obviously I kind of just got this candle because I wanted to see what the hype was like and I just wanted it for collection purposes, but yeah i don't i don't know about this one now this next candle i absolutely knew i wanted i hope it's amazing because i definitely can see myself getting a back of this i still might just because this is pink gumball and again the packaging is very kind of ugly i don't really love this I'm not really feeling this but i mean it's not always about the packaging okay but this is rainbow gumdrops, sugar vanilla, and pink spun sugar. This smells exactly like bazooka bubblegum. Like to the T, it smells extremely sweet and powdery, just like the bazooka bubblegum. I cannot wait to burn this one. Now I am hearing that the burn, the throw, it's not really crazy on this one, but honestly, I love bubblegum anything like it smells very similar to the bubblegum pop body care just without like that citrus note in here. I love this. I really, really do. It makes my mouth water as soon as I open it. It smells so good. So I am extremely happy to have this one. All right, now down to the last three candles. These are all from the like tropical line. First one is a pineapple mango and it looks like this. I have had pineapple mango before in the past. I love this candle. This is fresh pineapple juice, mango, vine, ripen, raspberry. This smells so good every single time. One of the best tropical like candles that I love to burn in the summertime. It's just so good. 
I feel like it is a really, really nice mixture of pineapple and mango. I do get a bit of raspberry in here, but the raspberry is not heavy to me in the candle. But y'all know they came out with the pineapple mango body care, right? And I definitely picked it up. It's an online exclusive, but yeah, I, I love this candle. It smells amazing. And I have picked this up almost every year since it's been coming out and I love it. Okay. Now this candle, I don't know if I've ever had this one before. I could have a long time ago. This one is also from the tropical line and this is pink pineapple sunrise. Y'all, I am a sucker for pineapple. Pineapple is one of my favorite fruits ever. Um, it's very sweet and citrusy and I love it. So anything with pineapple, I'm usually down to try. This is sweet pink pineapple, palm sugar and sun drenched nectar. To me, this smells a little slightly different than a body care. The body care to me is like way more like tart and sour. But this one is so good. It's so good. Now, pineapple mango and pineapple pink, pink pineapple sunrise are completely different. They definitely smell like completely different in body care and in candle form. So you can have both if you want to. I really enjoy this one. Um, and I love it. This very last candle, which is also from the tropical line, is going to be sweet kiwi and star fruit. Yeah, this is my first time ever having this candle. I want to say it was out last year. I'm not 100% sure, but I don't think I ever picked this one up. But they also have this new and body care this year, and it is good. Okay, so yeah, this one is golden kiwi, juicy star fruit, and solar woods. Now I love kiwi as well. Kiwi to me is not; it's a little bit more bitter than like a pineapple, but I still enjoy it. And this one smells so pretty. I actually think my husband would enjoy this one too because he does like fruity candles. But this one, there are, um, woods in here. I don't know it's it's doing something so i am really really enjoying this candle y'all that is my little candle haul i cannot wait to burn these candles like i am so excited for spring and summer right now like you have no idea so yeah guys that is it thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you in another video bye